Now let's take a look at an example of calculating the area and the volume of a cylinder. So a soup can has a diameter of 8 centimeters and a height of 15 centimeters. For part A, we're going to calculate the volume of the can. Later on in part B, we'll calculate the surface area of that can. So this is what the can looks like on the right hand side. Now we said we have 8 centimeter diameter and a, a height of 15 centimeters. So those are our two givens, a diameter of 8, which equals a radius of 4, since the radius is always half of the diameter. And our height of 15 is also a given. What we require is the volume. Now, we've said that the volume of a cylinder is the same as the volume of a rectangular base. The only difference is the uh, calculating the area of the base, which in this case is a circle. So first we need to find the base area, which is pi r squared and multiply that by its height. So let's make our substitutions. 4 is our radius, which is half of our diameter, and we're going to square that, and then we'll multiply it by 15. Let's go ahead and use our calculators to solve this. So first let's find out what 4 squared is equal to. Well, 4 squared equals 16, and now we can multiply that by pi, and next we need to multiply by 15, which equals 753.98, which will bring you to a final answer of 754 cubic centimeters. Therefore, the volume of the can is approximately 754 cubic centimeters.